Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Anil, and in this Laravel video tutorial, we will learn about the grouped middleware. What is the grouped middleware? How we can make it? How we can register it? And how we can apply it with the routes? And at the last, I will ask you an interview question. You can attempt this interview question in the comment box if you want. If you don't want, then please read about it. If you don't know the answer of this question, at least, right? So in the previous video, we learned about what is the middleware and about the global middleware. So if you want to watch this video, link is given in the description box. So now question is what is grouped middleware? So let's say we have the 20 routes and uh, we want to apply some middleware only on the 10 routes or specifically on the five routes. So how we can apply the middleware on some specific routes, right? For that, we will actually use the grouped middleware. So now let's uh, create some pages first of all, and then we will just apply the middleware on it, right? So I'm just going to make some pages in a view like uh, user.blade.php I already have. Then let's just uh, remove the extra thing from here, right? Here you can see that. And uh, let's make me one more middleware, uh, one more view, which is home.blade.php. And I'm just going to create one more for uh, no access no access dot blade dot php right and now just hit it let's make a h1 tag here and just simply write here you cannot access this page this page right and similarly just go for the home and uh, let's put some text this is home page or something right so that's okay so now let's make the routes for them just go for the fab.php and just create the three routes for all of them just write a route view and uh, just put a url for it and the view file name home and similarly let's create two more for the users Oh, my bad and uh, then at the last for no access right so now uh, let's create a middleware here and apply okay so first of all first of all let's try to access them are they are able to accessible or not so just put here home this is working users uh, okay users not found what's wrong with it because I don't put here users so now this is working now no access this is also working so now let's create a middleware so just simply write here php artisan make middleware and middleware name let's say is check hit the enter middleware is created where it is created in the app http middleware and here it is right so now let's register it for that let's go to the kernel.php and keep in mind in the previous video we register our uh, is check uh, middleware inside the global array right on that one now we will register it inside the uh, middleware group right so just put any group name like protected pages protected page or something whatever you want to put the name here and uh, now let's uh, just define any route name copy and paste it and change the name with the change age right so now uh, let's put a condition inside it so just go here and let's write here if the age is uh, less than 18 then um, uh, user should be just redirected on the uh, no access space right just like this so just put here dollar request is is requested and dollar request age is less than 18 right so then what should we need to done return redirect and what we need to redirect here so just uh, write here on the redaction page which is no access like this 
and uh, now let's apply this middleware on the routes also so just go to the web.php and i want to check the age only for the one route so let's say for the home right and uh, we just want to check the uh, age only for the two routes not for the all right so we will just do this thing here so just right here route group and uh, it have an array in the first array we will just tell that we are going to apply a middleware here so just right here and uh, it have an array and we will put our middleware name protected route protected page sorry uh, let me check the name once again so is it fine okay protected page just right here it's not protect page right and let's uh, okay this is also again an array so just use it like an array here and let's close the f f just use uh, anonymous function in the second parameter and here we can put over the routes that we want to use for uh, where we want to filter the age right so just put it like this and i need to remove this comma from here right okay so let's access the home first of all and my age is 10 so now you can see that this is accessible because this route is not registered inside the middleware right and now let's do the same thing with the users page and now you can see that we got the no access page right so even you can we can just go for the welcome page also with the age 10 this is working fine right so let's apply the welcome page also inside the middleware like this and now if i'm just going to use for the welcome page then it will just give us the no, no access page so that's that this is the way that how we can use the uh, group middleware so if you have any question you can ask me in the comment box now it's time to answer your question so my question is that can we use the two routes or two middleware uh, with the single uh, grouped route right so just answer this question in the comment box if you want and uh, bye bye and take care